वन वन थिंग इज द एवरेज वैल्यू ओके वन थिंग इज द मैक्सिमम वैल्यू एंड वन थिंग इज द आर एम एस वैल्यू ओके हेयर आर एम एस स्टैंड फॉर द रूट मीन स्क्वेयर राइट सो आई एम ड्रॉइंग द वे फॉर्म लाइक एन ए सी सप्लाई डू यू नो विच सप्लाई वी गॉट एट अवर होम ए सी और डी सी ए सी ए सी इज द साइनसॉइडल सप्लाई साइनसॉइडल मीन्स दिस इज अ साइन वेव ओके एज इट स्टार्ट फ्रॉम जीरो डिग्री वन एटी डिग्री एंड एंड सेट थ्री सिक्सटी डिग्री ओके इफ आई एम सेंग दैट टेल मी द मैक्सिमम वोल्टेज मैक्सिमम वोल्टेज इज दिस वन ओनली दैट हाउ मच इट गोज मैक्सिमम राइट दिस इज द मैक्सिमम वैल्यू लाइक सपोज इट गोज अप टू टू फोर्टी सो टू फोर्टी इज द मैक्सिमम वैल्यू now we need to know rms value rms is value is how can we calculate rms value for that we need to calculate at each an instant at each an instant of time value of voltage like at this point voltage is v1 at this point voltage is v2 at this point voltage is v3 up to so on we need to calculate at each and every instant of time we need to calculate voltage up to vn okay so vrms we need to calculate vrms is how much according to it that is root so i i have taken root then i have to take mean mean means v1 square plus v2 square plus v3 square up to so on vn square divided by n because i have to take mean also and square also right now you got to know about the difference in the maximum value and the rms value can you tell me like at our home how much is the voltage we are getting from the government supply that is 220 volt we are getting at our home like this we are having socket na at our home right so at this socket we are getting 220 volt from the government so this 220 volt according to you should be the maximum voltage or the rms voltage according to you rms correct we got from the government side rms so for all calculation okay so for all calculation we'll use rms only and there is one relationship between the rms and the maximum that is muted from your side there is one relationship from the R, for the rms and maximum that is v rms is equal to v max divided by root okay this is same for the current as well that is i rms is equal to i max divided by root 2 so whenever they say the calculation like they have said this much is voltage applied across r and c right so that voltage they have given is the rms it is understood that they have given the rms value only they don't give um the maximum value okay this is the rms value so for all calculation we need rms value and now the question is where they have given maximum value maximum value they have given always in the form of equation there is one standard equation what is the standard equation that is v is equal to v max sin of omega t plus phi okay what is the standard equation this is the standard equation for the voltage for the standard equation for the current is also i is equal to i max sin of omega t plus phi see how we'll get the standard equation like suppose this is the voltage for the so suppose this is the waveform for the voltage here v is the v maximum right and this is the sinusoidal waveform that's why it is represented by the term sin and this is omega t okay this is omega t because there it is 0 degree here it is 180 degree and here it is 360 degree okay so it is the sinusoidal waveform okay we'll just hold for a while
hello yeah got it so that's why they have that omega t and here this is start from zero so that's why in this case phase angle is zero if it starts from minus 90 degree then phase angle would be 90 degree clear so whenever they will give the equation they can give you the equation in this form that is v is equal to 230 root 2 sine of 314t plus 5 okay now we need to calculate from the standard equation according to the standard equation v is equal to v max sine of omega t plus 5 if we we'll compare can you tell me what is the maximum value for the voltage they have given 230 root 2 and what is the value of omega if we we'll compare omega is how much that is 314 so from this omega we can calculate phi right that would be 50 hertz because there is a formula omega is equal to 2 pi f from this v maximum we can calculate rms also that is v max divided by root 2 we know the value of v max we can calculate rms for the calculation okay if they'll give normal value then they have given rms value they don't mention if they have given maximum value then they'll give definitely in the form of equation and i told you the relationship between the maximum value and the rms value clear this is the same for the i so also that is i rms is equal to i max divided by root 2 yeah this is for the sinusoidal wave yeah yeah therefore that the concept is different i'm telling you for the general okay next one is the average value for average value we are having formula that is i average is equal to 2 i max divided by pi okay i average is 2 i max divided by the pi you need to just remember the formula there is one more formula one is form factor okay one is peak factor form factor is denoted by the term kf and peak factor is denoted by the term kp formula for the form factor is what rms value divided by the average value and for peak factor formula is maximum value divided by the rms value okay rms value is we know that is v max divided by root 2 suppose i am taking for v max and average value is how much 2 v max divided by pi i average is 2 i max by pi so v average would be 2 v max by pi so v max v max cancel out we can solve it and then we'll get 1.11 so form factor value is fixed for each case that is 1.11 okay similarly we can put it here also v max v max is how much that is v max is how much that is v rms multiplied by root 2 divided by v rms so if we'll solve v rms v rms cancel and peak factor would be root 2 that is how much 1.414 so it is fixed for the root 2 okay clear this thing this is the concept of all form factor, peak factor, RMS value and average value.